The brief. In Denmark, about 95% of the population drinks wine, but only a few percent would attest to being knowledgeable about wines. Actually, most people were afraid to offer their opinion on wines. At the same time, French wines were rapidly losing market shares to new world markets such as Australia, South Africa and South America, which many consumers found less pretentious and less complicated. The challenge. How can we make normal wine drinkers want to participate in discussing and talking about Rhone wines? The insight. The elitism of language and terminology restricts normal people from taking part in wine conversation. The solution. We decided to create a whole new language around which we wanted to talk about wine, which was open and including instead of closed and elitist. To personify the concept, we chose Pierre Pellison, who's a well-known loved Danish actor who has always been very passionate about wine, at the same time as being perceived as one of the people and anything but elitist. To kick off the concept, we created a number of films which ran both on television as well as online. The message of the films was simple and clear learnings about wine and the usage hereof. On the website, you could sign up to a newsletter filled with inspiration about Rhone wines, written in an informal and including way. We also created banners and takeovers with the same clear message. We invited people to participate in a competition where the grand prize was a trip to Rhone, of course held in an informal and including way. At the same time, you could become friends with Pierre Pallison on Facebook and ask any questions about wine you might have, as well as participate in informal wine discussions with other wine lovers. Since the launch, we've introduced Thomas Rohe, the chef at the Michelin awarded restaurant of Kong Hans, who offers advice on which food goes well with which wines. We kick this off by hosting a huge wine and food tasting at the National Opera for the followers of the website. The result. The campaign generated more than 250,000 unique visitors on the website, where people spent an astonishing nine and a half minutes on average. The newsletters sent out were open by more than 70%, and half of those went directly to visit the website. Finally, sales of Rome wines in Denmark have gone up by 27%, resulting in Rome wine today being the most recognized brand of red wine in Denmark.